Get back and grab a drink. Oh, I'm muted. My bad. Uh, <laughs> how far away did you say it was about? Just um, there. From from you or from the edge? Uh, from like me. Like if I was to grab something nearby. Uh, probably like sixty feet away from you. Okay, perfect. So I'm just gonna like grab like a big chunk of like concrete or some kind of rubble. I mean, there's and... like rocks that were piled up on the. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to grab one of those, and because like I can technically throw a 5,000-pound boulder oh, over yeah. 80 feet, I'm just going to chuck that over there. Yep, lob <laughs> the shot put. Yep, so uh, that would be a 10 to hit that spot. Okay, yeah, so you're just throwing it at the the ground, pretty much? Yep, yep. Okay, so it uh, Rudge tells you about the gravity there and you, you being a genius throw it like up a little ways and then it sort of like gets pulled down once it goes into the gravity bubble and just like slams down into the ground like a uh, like a little missile practically um switch and just, like smash into rubble uh and that impact is enough to crack the ground around him um let's see okay so he he tries to hold on with his tail to the building, but he just does not have a good enough grip, and he goes <laughs> sliding down to join his friend at the bottom of the pit. Piss or off. At the bottom of this part of the pit, which is a couple hundred feet down. Well, maybe like 200 feet. Um, Alright, sorry. Yeah. Got another goddamn black hole. Um, God, you're, you're just a popular person tonight, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, I know, between work people and fake fake people <laughs> All right. um yeah so they're done for the round or for the melee uh you're not okay. sure if they are planning on coming after you again they both seem pretty upset uh at your shenanigans yeah i mean out of spite they might come after us yeah exactly if they think about it for a half a second they'll realize no they shouldn't yeah um I mean, if you want to keep them down there, I'm pretty sure you can rudge with gravity stuff. Well, I can, but then I can't. Then I can't. No. Gravity. Yeah, exactly. So you'd be at like a stalemate. Uh, so, hello. I've got them pinned down at the bottom. If you want to, uh, still attempt to retrieve this, we could get rid of the rubble until it's ready to go, and then I will float it and shrink it and we can be on our way yeah i feel like that'd be a good idea just for like the rest of the round while they're technically out of combat per se mm -hmm. we'll just destroy the rubble around it to make it as easy as possible for rudge to lift it up okay. and then we'll see how things are next round yes. like if they're, if they're planning on coming back up then i'll definitely engage all right yeah so next round uh just roll initiative again i mean worst case scenario rudge just throw the fucking tank at one of them yeah <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's, that would work. Like, I, the I tank could, is cool, but... It could increase its weight and slam them to death. <laughs> yep. All right. Uh, huh. Two and 19. Uh, what's your initiative modifier? Who? Whoever got a 19. None and none. Okay. <laughs> I just want to point this out. I rolled an at one. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Well, I got a two, so we're doing good. Well, <laughs> I guess you're. So, <laughs> so technically, I got a seven minus yeah. that one. Um. So you got but a I, 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 if you're going based off standard rifts rules, I lose my first attack for the round. Okay. Yeah, that, I that do seem rule. to recall that. Yep. Um. Oh, okay. that is the. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> yeah. Which may, it makes sense in this situation where she's like hyper focused on making sure. Yeah, you're not her. really paying attention on to them because like they're not they're not gonna be a huge problem right away, right? Right. Uh, <laughs> until they climb up this whole thing in one turn and grab me. Yeah. We'll see. <laughs> um. It was a good attempt. Just just leave it be. Yeah, we just have loudspeaker us talking <laughs> shit, shit to them the whole time. Yep. All right, so they both 
unwind themselves, uh, or they, they spent the whole last melee getting their shit together. And they start climbing back up the wall, uh, one on either side. Uh, they get about halfway up in this round. Um, maybe like a third of the way. Your climbing skills, skills are quite impressive, though, I will say. Yeah, they're like digging in with their claws and then like using the muscles of their tails to like propel themselves up. <laughs> um, so they're I, both climbing with 50 on them? Uh, well, they got out of, they like dragged themselves out of the 50 area. And actually thinking about the, the area probably wouldn't have gone down the cliff with them. But, uh, yeah, they're, uh, yeah, that's cool. I just wanted yeah. to know what they were, at, what they were doing. Yep. Uh, that brings it to zero's turn. Zap, zap. Zippity, zap, zap. Mm -hmm. Uh, he shoots the one he shot first. And okay. And again. Uh, for... What did he get? Uh, 16 plus 2, so 18. Okay, yep. Yeah, he gets a plus two to his shooty shoots. They uh, do seem fairly uh, agile when they're not being okay. slammed down upon with a lot of stuff. Uh, oh, imagine that. But yeah, it's yeah. still hard to dodge a laser. Yep, so 10 damage. All right. Laser scalpel. Or no, that's laser eye. Zoom. Yep. All right, uh, that brings it to Rudge. This willow is focused on the rocks. This is... they are quite persistent. Should I send them back down or quickly get this tank afloat? Uh, try wiggling the tank for you, see where we're at. <clears throat> right. At least maybe you can gauge how well, how loose it is. Drop all the things, weightless the tank. Okay, and kind of try and... Poke I mean, it up yeah. I mean if, if the tank is weightless, Willow could presumably try and like, like wrangle it too. Move it, yeah. So the tank goes like. Uh, let's see. I'm sure it gets jostled okay. around by the rocks. After yeah. The <laughs> it seems like it's fairly free now. Like you, you sort of upped the pace and cleared out most of the rocks above it. So you can probably begin to float it up out of the the pit. Uh, it's. Just with zero gravity, it's going to take a little bit because that's not a whole lot of like, yeah, uh, rough. acceleration. Yeah. Um, but yeah, you start to do that. Uh, then that brings it to the uh, snake dude's turn. Um, they climb up almost to the top. Um, still not quite within range. Um, I. Assume that you guys are both within line of sight of them, right? I mean, Rudge might not be, because if he's focusing on the tank, he might be behind it, but Willow would for sure be. Okay. Rudge, would you be at the edge of the cliff or a little ways back? Uh, I'd kind of be at towards the edge, I guess, because I'm looking okay. at these guys climbing. Yeah, you, you want to watch them. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you were keeping an eye on them, too. Yeah. Okay. Um, also, uh, I have that ripcord thing, and that's kind of like at the ready. Like any like I, I know that you don't get like you know held or free actions, but that's what I'm like. I'm consciously thinking about shooting that climb cord or whatever. Okay. Um, good to know. Uh, so. Uh, let's see. Oh. Willow has nothing like that, and she would definitely plummet to the earth. <laughs> <laughs> She's not really a contingency. It's more of like let's make up a new plan on the spot. Yeah. So this one right here... I rely uh, so heavily on my powers that I needed a contingency. The one that's focusing on Willow is going to... Eh, it's just going to throw another fireball at you. Fireball! Um, would you like to dodge? Fireball. No. Okay. Is it, is Again, it she, she probably doesn't even actually register <laughs> that it's being swung at her until it hits her. Then she's like, oh, hey. A thing. damage. Yeah, there's, there's uh, like... Then, yeah, One I'd of her sensors radiates. I'd say the fireball drink does about eight damage. Um, Rudge, I would like you to give me a save versus magic. All right. That's new. Yeah, that is. I get plus two to it. Nice. 
Come on, baby. Give me this good roll. Give me this I'm good roll. When we were in the crazy town where it made Willow kind of go insane, like fuck. Willow did not have a bonus. Fuck, fuck, <laughs> fuckaroo. You got a seven. Okay, that's definitely not enough. I know. Um, Hence the so swears. As you, uh, as you are focusing on levitating the tank, you you hear the sort of like harsh guttural hissing sound from the the this snake, and you see him make sort of like a weird sort of gesture with his claws, and uh, you feel this like pang in your leg, and then like a spreading numbness through it as you your knee kind of like buckles a little bit. You have oh. to like, shift to catch yourself. He gave uh, me fucking limb rack. Yeah. yeah right, right. So <laughs> your uh, your le- your right leg is paralyzed, uh, which gives you a minus two to parry and dodge, and reduces your speed by ninety percent. <laughs> All right, so I can move ninety feet you can, a turn. So you can like, hop. So so ninety feet a turn, divide or minus ninety percent of that. So nine yep. feet. <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's actually still not bad, actually. Yeah, no. I mean, that's pretty good hopping. Yeah. yeah. It's not Gary crawling, but... No. That's, <laughs> that's like some like really good like Jurassic Park level, like trying to get the hell away. Yeah. I could, um, get, I could get away from something. Something. I don't know what. <laughs> yeah. So that's their go. Uh, something that angry, but zero. not that agile. <laughs> All right. Zero uh, sees what happened. And... Uh, you tell us, by the way, <laughs> that you got paralyzed. Well, yeah, I, I suppose it's all comms. They're like, oh, God, my leg is wrought with pain. <laughs> or something. Maybe I don't feel pain, but it definitely feels bad. Oh, so yeah. mammals rot, too, like trees? No. It kind of feels like a, like that pins and needles sensation. Yeah, where your like, leg falls asleep. Yeah. No, 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 it is paralyzed by some means. <laughs> Well, it was like the worst. They're in like raving pain, and she's just questioning you on yep. mammal pain. No, it's okay. It's okay. I have morphine. I have morphine. It's, it's, I'm quite all right. Uh, actually, I do have injectors. Paralysis injectors. That'd be funny. <laughs> Paralyze yourself? Paralyze my own leg. No, no, I don't like Take this. Take that. If I'm going to be paralyzed, it at least better be a familiar paralyzation. <laughs> None of this magic m- bullshit. <laughs> All that magic crap. All right, all right. So I've, I'm on my last attack. Uh, the thing is floating. Well, is it floating? Uh, oh, you're, in your, you're, in, you're in your last attack. Yeah, because I did. Really? Yeah, I, I mean, this is fifth, right? I, I just did fourth to float it, I thought. No, no, we started a new it's, round. Cause yeah, we're this waiting. is a new melee. Oh. You've only done one attack. Where the fuck am I? All right, cool. I don't know. I, well, I, I thought we were still on first melee. Yeah. So, I missed. I mean, I, yeah, I, we even rolled new initiative. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> I'm trying to keep track, guys. God. Mm-hmm. Make sure I don't do seven attacks in one melee. Anyway. I mean, to be fair, I'm up there in that range. Mm-hmm. I'm not, so I'd be cheating. <laughs> uh, tanker them, tanker them. Tanker them! My leg's fucked up. <laughs> uh, keep focusing on the tank. My right. turn, I'll try. My my turn, I'll try and throw the tank up there so we can be done with that. All right. So All right. the tank, the tank is still a floaty bit. I grapple cord to not here. Okay. Actually, I think it, it's Willow's turn before yours this round because. Yes, I'm active this yeah. time. It's kind okay. of weird, but yeah. Yep. Yep. I will heave that thing as best heave I can the up tank. there. All right. So you're, are you using your um? You have jets, right? Yeah, I, are you, yeah. Are you gonna I, use those I too? Have sharks. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Okay. I, I, so, I like knowing what's below us. I'll use anything at my disposal to push us forward. With that, um, and the fact that you can just like what? Never seen insert it. thrust into this equation. Uh, you basically just like grab the bottom and just <laughs> give it a little burst, and it just sort of starts like spinning slowly up. Um, and you are able to pull it up out of the ground, so it's just sort of like spinning in the air now. Yeah, presumably that'd be my turn. All right, uh, then that brings it to Reg. All right, uh, floaty floaty bits, and uh, grapple the hell away. Where are you grappling to? 
Uh, I mean, our vehicle is probably relatively nearby. Yeah, grapple that I, thing. I don't know if I really want them to come at our vehicle, but yeah, <laughs> I, I will grapple our vehicle. Crushing. All right, so you like hook onto one of the like handles on the sides and yep. drag yourself over there. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 Lip no. leg and all. Yeah, just sort of like half hopping, half dragging your 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 lower half. Mm -hmm. um, very uh, very noble uh, escape. Will is recording that entire thing, by the way. <laughs> oh, I've been recording since we started the excavation. Yeah, but she's gonna replay on repeat, like you being dragged across the ground. But why? Like, I'm doing it myself. It's not like it's against my will. Yeah, but it probably looks very uh, ungentlemanlike. <laughs> there have been so many uncouth <laughs> things I've been doing at this on this planet. We're on a planet called Dirt. You think I give a shit about? <laughs> uh, etiquette here. However, yes, yes, it, it is. You seem to be defensive, so yes, I do. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> you read me like a book. Alright, uh, um. Yeah, so. That's Roger's turn. That brings it to their turn. Um. All right, so Willow's flying still. Um, oh, it should be presumably like nearby the ground, probably still though. Oh, okay. Because so, you know, like if she if she's moving the tank, she's presumably yeah close to it. Still be within like thirty feet of the ground. Yeah. Um. So this one gets up to the top and like lashes its tail out to try and wrap around you, Willow. Uh, okay, so you can make like that. try and parry that. I assume you want to. Roll high. Uh, I rolled fairly high, actually, and actually with, so... Oh, I'll use that to pluses, because power armor... Okay. Um... Uh, it's a 22. Not quite enough. That's okay. Uh, it happens. She's gotten lucky with a lot of things, so... Yeah. <laughs> so... Um, it wraps around, it like what? grabs your torso and wraps around you and sort of pulls you down towards it. Um, do not give consent. It take, you, or you take 11 points of damage and you are grappled by its giant constrictor tail. Is it 11 from being banged around? Yeah. Or is it just, because I can roll, or, can roll with that? From the, uh, uh, yeah, you could, you could try and roll with it. it it's from his like tail. Grapple. Well, well, I roll a fucking that one to roll with, so okay. no, I take full damage. So, so you don't roll with it. <laughs> I, I like literally face plant myself into the ground, like I wasn't even like planned to do that, and then it just happened. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's like, oh, I can get out of this, and just smash. You just watch her face go into the side of a building. All right, I record <laughs> that. <laughs> You're so graceful, aren't you? <laughs> like an uh, like a star angel. Yeah, falling from a tree. <laughs> All right, um, I've done this that. guy over here, uh, he climbs up to the top and very quickly catches up to you, Rudge. Oh! No! Uh, he's holding onto the, the side of the car there. No! Um, so he gets, like, up within, like, five feet of you uh, and, like, raises his claw up. Um, but uh... instead of attacking you, he kind of, like, crooks it in this sort of, like, weird Magic. sort of yeah twisted thing and just uh, hisses at you uh feel pain <laughs> uh, well, i mean i'm a magic i'm a doctor pain is natural not nothing to be afraid of and then this then the pain hits and we'll see yeah we'll we'll see how much the pain hits that's supernatural yeah. pain that's not okay <laughs> fuck man eight oh no okay Seven, then eight awesome um so you feel like someone just lit your nervous system on fire um oh it like excruciating unimaginable pain um damn it i don't like feeling that i can Cause hardly yeah. imagine because that's what i mean <laughs> like I, ah my guy's too distinguished to care <laughs> but now he has to <laughs> Because, you know, pain hurts. Agonizing pain, yes. All right. Uh, I, I, I just 
fucking numb up. I stab myself with paralyzers. I don't care. Okay, so you, you from the the like onset of that, you lose uh, everything but one attack left. Okay. And you as you sort of like seize up. Uh, um, do you need assistance? Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah. That brings it uh, back to zero. I guess zero is uh, sensors of my vitals would be going crazy. Yeah. And he Although, goes over. I don't know how much, because, like, well, I don't know if you have a way of measuring pain. You're, I guess your neural, like, yeah, your, your neural synapses are well. firing like crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they act, on, as a side note, they actually do specify that supernatural pain does register on sensors. Okay, yeah. There, There is a thing for that, just so in case, just in case you didn't know. All right, so that's, that's terrible, and Zero comes over and shoots that thing in the face. All right. Uh, oh, of course, I got a fucking 15 to shoot. Couldn't get a 15 no, yeah. to save. That, yeah, that would have been nice to get. <laughs> uh, 10. 10? Yep. All right. Uh... It's good. It's okay. Uh, that brings it to Willow's turn. So does Willow still have to focus on the tank, or is the tank good on its own currently? Uh, the tank is out of the hole. Um, floating. Yeah, it's it, kind of like spinning around a little bit. So is it like floating up over the hole, or like on land, where like if it fell, it'd be okay? Uh, on land mostly. It, okay. If it fell, it probably wouldn't fall back into the into the crevice. Okay, so I'm gonna try something super badass here. I'm gonna make sure it's all right with Ben first. So my drone's missile can hit a mile away. Yep. Uh, it has one armor piercing one. It's gonna shoot at the one that rudges. <laughs> all right, yeah. Block. From so, downtown. So here's the thing, yeah, this is super long shot and I'm hoping that like, you can interpret however you want because technically it just uses its base bonuses because it's an unguided missile. So it's whatever yeah. it can do that with Willow's intelligence, she could calculate it. So yeah, uh, roll and you apply whatever penalty you want, if there is a penalty. All right. Uh, that is a fucking nat 20. <laughs> no penalty there. <laughs> they can stop it. It's definitely unaware. Um, unfortunately, no crit for missiles, but. Uh, it's armor piercing, so it doesn't have blast radius, so it can crit. It's the, if I, let me double check. I will double check. I have the page brought up here because I think the ones without explosive. Nope, never mind. Does not. Yeah. Do, do, do. That makes sense. Still good though. I'm so I just shoot. It. <laughs> so I'm like, Rudd, do you need assistance? And you're like, oh. and then only a uh, missile just hits the thing in the face from like, like uh, across the canyon. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> uh, so that is 40 damage. So I rolled max damage anyway. So that worked. Nice. Okay. So. It just like gets hit in the back and ugh, kind of like looks around like, where the hell did that come from? <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, yeah, take that. <laughs> now it's Willow's actual turn. And all right. So is she is she up out of the canyon, too, or is she still in the uh, she, canyon? She's grappled by this thing. Oh, yeah, that's right. I totally forgot that she's involved yeah. with this stupid <laughs> thing. Uh, hmm. I don't like that. Uh, I think I'm just going to blow up one of my plasma grenades. Seeing as this thing's like literally like wrapped around us. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to, I'm just going to fucking trigger a plasma grenade. All right. Yeah. Okay. okay fuck you it's then. Like, I don't care about taking the damage. <laughs> yeah. Like worst case now it's going to destroy my armor a little, little bit. Yeah. I am immune to plasma damage. So go to hell. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Um, I mean, he probably would like to do that, actually. Yeah, <laughs> probably like, bring me home. This place sucks. <laughs> why? Why did we go to a planet called Dirt? <laughs> okay. Fucking dirt. And Twenty. Uh so twenty-six damage, and then all right, whatever for him being wrapped around it. If you want to count that. Um. Yeah. He's. I mean. <laughs> He's also pretty big. Yeah, I'll do a little more damage from that. 
Yeah, I mean, I was just thinking because like it's like a real grenade. If you like smother it, you die basically. Yeah. Um, that like it has a it twelve foot blast hurts radius. A right? lot. Um, like you can see its scales like melting and stuff from the yeah. like ridiculously intense heat. Yep. Um, probably got some kind of resistances though. Yeah. Too. Yeah. <clears throat> That's kind of what she's testing out. I think I'm pretty sure from your experience, every demon like creature that you fought has been at least resistant to fire or plasma. Yeah, she's starting to pick up on that. Um, yeah. So that brings it to Rudge's turn. Rudge, you have one action. Were you going to <laughs> paralyze yourself? So you don't uh, feel this agonizing pain? Possibly. I drop the I drop everything else. Yeah, you know, or unless that was all taken away already, like the the tank and all that. Um, no. Okay. So yeah, I dropped that, so it's just sitting okay. there now. Um, it lands on its the the right side up. Okay. <laughs> it kind of like drops down on a corner and like spins once, and then just like lands on the on its bottom. Perfect. And then is this guy <laughs> grappling me? No, nope, not yet. Actually, he's currently really sort of... He's not even looking at you. He's looking over, trying to figure out what hit him for 40 damage. Okay. I'm just wondering, yeah, if he was close. But... He's right next to you, yeah. Yeah, he's, like, on top of you. Oh, that's right. I'm not grappling you. Is he within... Is he, he said within five feet. Yes. Okay. Oh, hey, what's up, man? Uh, So I was wondering if I could... Uh, if my thermal venting reaches out that far... Uh, five feet? Yeah, pretty sure. Okay, because they are fire creatures. They came from the mm -hmm. fucking depths where it's all hot and bothered. So I'm wondering maybe uh, Cryo oh, Freeze will, will do some damage. That does not do damage, uh, oh. but it, it's like a, a vapor cold smoke screen. It might do damage against something that's very fire aligned. Yeah, that's kind of what I was... Yeah, because I, I was reading it. And I know it doesn't do damage, but now I'm thinking maybe it would. Yeah. All right. If you want to do that, then. Yeah. So I'll. I'll oh, that's I'll... a free action to activate. Okay. So I'll do that. And see what happens. Okay. So, um, this like cold, thick, like white vapor just like surrounds you like a mini blizzard. Um. Yeah. It's a twenty foot radius around you. Oh wow! Yeah. Yeah. It's 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 pretty big. Um. And uh, he does not seem to like it. You hear him kind of go like, ah, "What?" Um, and it's it's like thick, obscuring mist. Um, so you you lose sight of him. <clears throat> even with even cool, even with the th uh, thermals and all that. Yep, it the the uh, venting specifically foils thermal imaging because of its. Cool. It's uh, properties. That's good to know. Yeah. Uh, what? Two fifty. Um. Do you, would you like to do anything else other than exist in crippling agony? Oh. Ah, uh, two <laughs> one twenty-five apiece. Uh, I got. I got a fiver. Here's one forty. Okay. Oh, oh, one twenty-five apiece. I don't have, I don't have five. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Okay. Alright, I just, uh, I just blast him with another, um, gravity well then. 50, okay. 50, 50, 50 times, times right where he was. Yep. Alright. And then I try to get in the fucking vehicle. I don't know. Um, alright. Yeah, uh, kind of like fumbling with the door a little bit. Uh, part of the way in. Um, and... Uh, okay, so that's all right. That's Roger's turn. Their $1 turn. Dollar shy. Uh, this and guy. Is oh, you do. All right. Upset. Um, okay, so this one with you, Willow. Uh, he's gonna just like try and crush I'll you. It, though, I'm bad. Um, so you take nineteen damage cool. from him squeezing you. And, uh... Okay, what do I take? No, this is Willow. Oh, okay. It. Okay, sorry. Yeah, sorry, that was, you know, had to... 
had, had things happening. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sounds busy over there. Yep. Um, and then he's going to try and... Uh... Well, yeah, he's going to sort of move his hand over towards your face and do the same thing he did to, to Rudge and say, uh, Feel our pain. Oh, he gets two attacks? Uh, while he's grappled, the damage is automatic for the tail thing. Oh, I see. While he's he's grappling you. Uh, so you can go ahead and give me a save versus magic. Uh, I don't have any bonuses, so 14. That is enough. Um, also, I'm not really sure what that would do, since you don't have a nervous system. But, and... I mean, it's, ma it's, it's magical. It's magic, so I, I, yeah. Yeah. I've always been the one to just ignore that and say it's like yeah. it's more psychological. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it hurts That you. makes sense. Uh, but you are able to resist. You feel, for a little bit, you feel like this sort of strange feeling, um, but you just suppress it. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm sure she gets a lot of those. <laughs> hmm, what's going on here? Whatever. Uh, and then this guy <laughs> is... Uh, he's just gonna, like, blindly claw around him. Out of my face. I don't think this is gonna be very effective, given his... Yeah, okay. You hear him thrashing around, trying to fight with the times 50 and, uh, and blindly hit you in this, uh, in this haze, and he does not do anything of the I, sort. I don't know what you're doing to my body, but I bet you don't know what I'm doing to yours. <laughs> um, he hisses angrily. <laughs> hmm. uh, that brings it to zero. This shoots the bits. Okay. Um, let's see if I can hit. That hit. Who, who's he shooting at? The guy that's fucking with me. Okay. For, uh, uh, for so he can't time. really see the the bulk of his body, but he could shoot at the tail because the tail's big enough to yeah, that, that'll work, but I got a five. Yeah, of the area. Okay. Uh five I believe it's five is it five or and below for within fifty feet? Um uh, I'm on get... I think so. Like... Give me, give me two seconds. I'm like right here, actually. Yeah, five or <clears throat> five or higher to hit in melee, and nine or higher if beyond fifty. So yep, five. Okay. All yeah. Right. So that hits Eight just barely. Damage. All right. Zip zip. Uh, okay, that brings it to Willow's turn. Okay. So yeah, I think Willow's gonna try and get out of this grab because grab I'm is. not as fun as she would like it to be. Yeah. Grab is great. Kind of, a, uh, kind of a bummer. So I think what she'll do, as seeing as these guys seem to like being on the ground, she's going to use her jets to f basically, she's going to kick her jets on afterburn and try and go over the canyon, basically, and wiggle around. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, so... Just check how... I think I'm pretty sure the jets will be strong enough to lift the both of you. But let's make sure this guy isn't like the jillion pounds. Yeah, because you with something that big could be. Yeah. Uh, okay, so he weighs a ton, literally. <laughs> um, so you don't go up very far with the jets. Um, hey, something is better than nothing. Probably like 20 or 30 feet. Uh, and he seems kind of annoyed that you're doing that. That's um, the plan. <laughs> annoy them to death. Yeah, annoy them till they give up. Willow's general train of thought. All right. Uh, that brings it to uh, Rudge's up attacks. That brings it to their turn. Um, oh, no. Oh, sorry. Um, so the drone's actually going to start to close in on us. Okay. Uh, it can travel. So it's going to kick on its like little like high speed thing. So it can travel 300 feet per round per turn. All right. So yeah. It's gonna start, it's gonna start flying back towards us. Sounds good. Because it um, does. Because its lasers have a twelve hundred foot range. So once it gets within that range, it gets shooting. Okay. So this guy takes his tail and like spends uh, 
the rest of his attacks, dragging himself back out of the times 50 area and uh, dealing with that scenario. So he's by the edge now uh, and kind of like just out of the uh, the cryo fog, um, kind of like trying to reassess his surroundings. Uh, this one, who you're flying up with, Willow. Um, so you take... Well, th does she get a roll to try and break the grapple? Uh, Isn't that what she was trying to do? Oh, yeah, you were trying to break it with by flying up, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I guess I just didn't even think about it. I was just like, okay, yeah, you want to fly up? Sure. Um, yes, by all means, try and break the grapple. <laughs> Uh, that is an awesome brick and roll this time. Uh, so Nat 17 on the die. Oh, yeah. Probably gonna get it. Because I believe that is against dodge when it's grappling. Because it takes me my attack. Yeah, it's against dodge for mm -hmm. entanglement. Uh, so that is a grand total of... Dang it. Where did that go? Sorry. So I'm flying. Blah, blah, blah. So that's a 28. <laughs> yep, that's enough. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Yeah, so you wiggle and uh, he drops back onto the ground. Um, Over the canyon? Uh, Yeah. Bitch. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> okay, so he... Because that was the plan. Um, he he does manage to like grab a claw out and like scrape it down the side of the wall and catch himself, but he does he falls about halfway down before he get gets to that point. Um, so now he's all the way down there. Uh, I guess he'll spend his turn moving back up. Yeah. Uh, well, hmm. um, he kind of just like are you annoyed yet? Down sir? there and. <laughs> And just like stares at you. <laughs> Broods for uh, a moment. Yeah, he's brooding this round. <laughs> um, so that brings it to zero. Alright. Uh, sir, are you alright? Sir, are you alright? <laughs> uh, I'm like, <laughs> fuck! I hurt! I hurt so bad! I don't. I wish I didn't hurt so much. Paralyze me, zero. Just fucking put me out. <laughs> Use your use your six shooter, Poncho, and sh put put one in my head. <laughs> put you down. Yep, put me down. Yeah, we're totally getting him like one of like uh, Paul's laser pistols right. when we get back. You need to mercy kill me. I've I, I've had it. I've got a I've got a bum leg, and 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 my my ticker is going. On the bright anyone. side, your leg does not hurt as much as the rest of your body. Oh, you know, <laughs> I guess that is the bright side. Say so it's yeah. like for anyone hearing this, this sounds awful. Like what he wants to kill himself, but you've probably like spent years typing in all the different things you would say. Yeah. <laughs> that way yeah. he doesn't actually shoot you in the head. Yeah, yep. right, right. <laughs> okay. So Zero comes over, says, hey. Ah, buck up. You'll be fine. Rub some dirt in it. <laughs> and goes and shoots this guy. Okay, the, the guy's still up there? Yep, yep. Alright. Uh, for, yeah, a hit, I think. Uh, 13. Ah, uh, yep. And uh, 12 damage. Alright. <clears throat> so that brings it to Willow's turn. All right. Uh, how are you actually doing, Rudge? Do you need my assistance with that one, or can I keep shooting at this one? Um, I don't, I don't know how to feel sensations anymore. All right, I'm just gonna start shooting at the one that's by him. Okay. <laughs> just like, uh, hmm. She's gonna fly up a little bit higher though, so that one below me can't just like reach out and grab me at some point. Yeah. But I'm not <laughs> paying attention. Uh, so yeah, so that would be a 18 to hit him. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, that's that's definitely gonna hit. Okay. So 20 damage. Okay. So this one is has 
taken enough combined fire that his his injuries are starting to show on his side. Uh, okay. Not to the point where like he looks like he's gravely injured, like about to die or anything, but it, like he looks weathered. Um, and then that's Raj. Uh Okay, so this one. Let's see. Brings it back to their turn. Still got attacks left. I mean, I'm assuming. Uh, yeah, uh, this one doesn't have attacks left, but this guy does. They have a, a pretty good amount of attacks. Um, yeah, I was assuming monsters at higher levels and whatnot, stronger ones tend to do that. Yeah, so this guy slithers down further into the, the cave and kind of like under an overhang. Um, and he goes far enough in that you're you're pretty sure that there's there has to be like a, a chasm or like a cavern or something carved out into it because like his entire body disappears under it. Yep. Um, so he seems to be done with this. <laughs> Decided that it's too much work. Oh, uh, dude, that this just, was he just idea. ditched it, ditched his buddy completely. Um, so then, if Zero and Willow have more attacks, they can shoot the shit out of this guy if they would like. <laughs> yeah, Willow does too. So, beep beep. Yeah, go ahead and roll him. Same for zero. Uh, that would be a 14 to hit. All right, and, yeah. Uh, and then a 14 to hit. Nice. <laughs> Assuming they both hit at the first one. Oh, that's... Oh, that looked really good. And I looked at the other two dice, and they were the exact opposite. <laughs> that's still actually pretty good. So 25 for the first one. Uh, 25. Okay, nice. And 25 for the second one. Okay, literally two identical rolls. Yeah, that was good damage. damage for zero. Unless you heard that right. Ten, ten damage. Okay. Uh, That's did he have? Did he only have one attack left? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, it, yeah, it's definitely looking not healthy now. Uh, after that, 60 one damage. Why don't you get out of here while you're still um, hide? So that's the end of the melee. Uh, it, it does look like it's planning on slinking away. Um, if... Presuming we can grab the tank, I'm happy to let it go. Okay. I have no desire to just kill things at, like, random. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I don't have a specific desire to kill <laughs> demons, like... I don't yeah, have that form really, of moral compass. Like, it's another creature to me. Not really familiar with supernatural evil. So yep. Makes sense. Uh, how about Zero? I mean, Rudge, uh, for for the next melee, uh, you, you're at half your attacks and uh, minus one to everything, pretty much. Half speed, too. So you, you can only hop at uh, four and a half feet. <laughs> so so it's half of minus 90 percent yep what the fuck <laughs> equation you got over there well you're paralyzed and then you're experiencing agonizing pain oh okay yeah that that math checks yeah <laughs> but wait a minute how can you experience agonizing well, pain only your leg is paralyzed. paralyzed like i said your leg doesn't feel so bad. <laughs> right, right. Okay, I get it. All right, so um, I weightless myself. Mm -hmm. Kind of float around a bits. Uh, yeah. I weightless the. Are we out of Are we out of combat? Uh, yeah, effectively. I, I weightless the tank, and I shrink it. Okay. Uh. Do you have like a pound limit to how much when yes I do material you can when I, you reduce the I have a right. pound, I have a pound limit to to item reduction. Yeah. Which but is not why to I, uh yeah, which weight, is why I uh, weight manipulation. Correct. There's no limit okay. on that. Yeah, so you you reduce it to zero and then you shrink it. Yes, I am breaking all the rules. Yep, no, that's that's called synergy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
That's called riffs in a nutshell. Yeah, yeah. However, I do have to concentrate, though. After six yeah, minutes... Yeah, you're still expending stuff. After six minutes, it becomes a concentration. Yeah, so this tank is pretty heavy, because, you know, it's a tank. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so it will take a little bit to reduce its weight to the point where you can shrink it, uh, but it looks like your snake demon friends decided to give up on you, so um, you can do that. Uh, the, the pain does not go away immediately. Um, it starts to recede after the first m m like round of uh, melee. Um, so, you know, instead of feeling like your nervous system's on fire, it, it feels just like you're being stabbed with a thousand knives. Um, and then it goes down to like a hundred knives. Oh, okay. And then just like the last round is, is only like... A guy with a knife, like a midget with a knife. Yeah, just like stabbing you in the back of the head. Oh, last, oh, last time we oh. had that conversation, that knife was dangerous. That chalk was scary. Yeah. <laughs> um, so it takes about a minute to fully fade. Uh, the leg paralysis does not fade by the time you uh, shrink the tank, which takes a couple of, like, probably like two or three minutes. All right. I, 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 I mean, do I have, like, like I said, do I have, like, morphine or anything besides... Yeah, I'm sure you have painkillers. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, you know, self-medicate. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then, just, you know, shrink it down and... I can't pocket it, because it can only go to 10th size, 10th scale. Yeah, it's still, like... It's, I could, like, back it. Yeah. <laughs> you I put mean... it, you could put it in the back of your right, truck. Right, right, because, yeah, we'll just, like, you know either put it in or lash it too because if for some reason I need to you quickly... probably want to lash it too yeah, yeah, so if, that, uh, yeah. explode inside of your yep, yep. for some car. reason if I need to drop that it for science work. purposes I feel like we need to put it inside now well okay <laughs> I will tell you what will happen it will grow to the size it can handle and then it will stop because I'm oh yeah that's sure right the yeah. power says it can't break yeah it can't explode surrounding down. things yes yeah, it can't be used as a weapon. Be, yep. It'll just be stuck in there. Yep. I can't Ant-Man a fucking uh, a tree and then feed it to somebody and then let the power go. Yeah. Yep. Here you go. Eat this little uh, pill. <laughs> and then let the power go and then boom! Yeah, you can't, you can't fly up Thanos' butt. Right, right, right. And then explode and expand and explode. <laughs> I mean, you could. You just couldn't expand and explode. Expand. Yeah, yeah, I could fly up there. <laughs> you just, yeah, not not a fun experience. It Too much be, purple. Don't be, you tell me what I cannot do. Yeah, it'd be it'd be pleasure, not business. <laughs> uh, anyways, oh, um, re real, real, real quick, about uh, five seconds on this. Uh, they kept Ant Man and Thanos away in the MCU because of that theory. Like so, really? like, So no one would bring that up. <laughs> like in the MCU, yep. Thanos like, and Ant-Man well, we, don't interact because they wanted to not even acknowledge that. The, like Ant-Man could have just done this. <laughs> like, nope, we're not. We're not even going there. They're never gonna meet. Not doing it, man. Yep. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, they actually mentioned that that that's why they kept them away from each other. Funny. So. Uh, yeah. So. You have the tank. On top of your yep. your ATV, yep. Um, doesn't seem to be any immediate threats. Uh, you are still paralyzed in the leg at the moment. Oh, but I feel better. Uh, but yeah, you feel better. I really am not uh, accustomed to pain. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Most people don't. Usually, a, a little bit here and there. You know, a bruising, a laser blast. It's okay. It's 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 quick. It's it's over. I have me I have medicines, but that was a direct assault on my pain receptors. Yeah, it was a bullshit level of pain. I did not enjoy and would not wish it upon myself ever again. Terrible. Zero out of ten would not <laughs> recommend. <laughs> Good to know. I will avoid having that happen to me in the future. What actually happened? I wasn't there. I don't know. I want uh, to ask our mage friend about that. It seemed as some sort of magical attack. It wasn't psionic. It didn't attack my brain. It just 
it just happened, and I couldn't resist. Yeah, the Dude. one try, the one tried to do a tingly thing to me, but I resisted because I'm strong in the brain. Mm. You don't have a brain. <laughs> <laughs> In my, ten, in my, what is it? Well, dang, I had a good, a good thing for that. In my, yeah, whatever. Keep going. Core. Yep. Uh, anyways, where are you guys gonna go now? Away. Uh, yep, I think we're good. I think the tank is enough reward. Oh, I'm sorry. The... Did, did the uh, did the paralyzing a nervous attack do damage? No. Okay, just wondering if I missed it. It was just painful. Okay. Debilitating. Yeah. Yeah. No, makes sense. Enough. That's bad enough. I just had to make sure. They basically pulled a U. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Just yeah. stop. And I'm like, oh. and It's a good thing you did the the coolant cloud because he was planning on taking you with him. Oh, sweet. And like, and did I re did I notice if it hurt at all? Like, if he he hissed, I know, but did it like did he recoil in pain or? Uh. Or just annoyance. I couldn't tell. I, it was probably. It seemed like more annoyance than anything. Okay. I uh, want to actually weaponize that. Weaponize that. The cool. Ah. I, I want to make it a, like a the focus blast and make it actually like so cold it. You does could damage. probably modify your suit to yeah, like a liquid nitrogen blast. Yeah. So cold it yeah. does damage. Like a cryo thrower type thing. Yep. Yeah. That'd be so, a thing. Yeah. A smoke screen that hurts them. Mm -hmm. I have a thing like that on my robot design. Cool. Yeah. Uh, it, it's to vent the heat. It's to vent the heat for the jump jets. Ah, well then, if you could <laughs> implement that into my uh, cooling system, uh, my vent, my ventilation, that would be great. I haven't need, I haven't thought of it up till now, but that was a fire-based creature, so it just hit me. Yeah, I don't know if. <laughs> They're particularly weak to cold, but they seem at least resistant to my plasma grenades. So mm, yes, and that's kind of what's led me down led me down oh, the that... path of thinking. <laughs> that reminds me, I'm repairing my armor. <laughs> that um, needs to be a thing. Yeah, just so you remember, also Reg, uh, when you when you do the thermal venting thing, you you Minus it takes like a, yeah, so your your AC is a little bit less efficient right now. Yeah, but... I'm on painkillers. I'm okay. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah. Let's see what can. Everything's stupid, anyways. Why not be uncomfortable too? Right, right, right. <laughs> Does like I give a shit. I'm already angry. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm trying to look at it uh, for like how, what that means for. It doesn't mean anything on on. You can survive on 25 percent capacity. It's okay. just uncomfortable. Gotcha. So um, I can do that. And it replenishes that 25 percent per day. Yeah, with a gallon of fresh water, which we have yep. back at home or somewhere. Yeah. I'm so, sure you, you, you guys have water. water. We have water with? Okay. Yeah. I suppose I need to drink. That's also Willow's only food, so yes. <laughs> we oh, have water. Okay. <laughs> I, I, we have you wonderful have water. water. Okay, cool. The best water. Then yes. Mm -hmm. uh, if you wouldn't mind, I need to replenish my system. Yes, why don't you take a load off, you and Zero. Maybe make sure, make sure he's keep an eye on your, you know, whatever you vitals. Animal calls. Yes, that thing. Your weak points. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Have him keep an eye on that, and I think we should just skedaddle out of here. As much as that tower really, really. Oh, I want to go to that, but I feel like today is not that day. Yeah. I mean, it seems mostly unguarded, aside from the guard, the st statue. Guard He's mostly unguarded, minus all the guardians. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, they're they're skiddling around near the bottom of the pit, or not near the bottom, but below the uh, the, t the like top edge. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I think the I think getting the tank out of here is a priority because we can use that pretty well. That's a really good score. Fair enough. All right, let's get it. As in, let's hit it. Let's get it out the fuck. <laughs> yeah. So I'll have the the drone scout out ahead of us a ways. Maybe plot our course a little bit better from the sky while, while I'm driving. See if that helps us get out of this town. All right. Can't we just go straight up? Straight up. 
Yeah. You mean like fly? Yeah. Uh, not. If, I feel like if you're resting, you should actually rest. Oh. All right. My body is racked. My mind <laughs> is all right, but I, get, I I understand. Um. Yeah. So. Uh, one thing to note: that after another minute or two, the paralysis in your leg fades. Okay. Actually, it doesn't. It doesn't fade. It just suddenly ends. Um, and I mean, like you, there isn't really any residual pain from the, the spell. Um, I so you're few, pretty much fine. I do a few llama kicks. Except for the, the mental, uh, strain of, of experiencing it. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> that's, that's better. I, uh, and I was like documenting it and then like all of a sudden it just went away. Like, Oh, all right. It's just gone then. <laughs> Good, but it's not how pain usually works of that magnitude. It's like I don't like this. Off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, so I definitely have to uh, talk with Cards McGee back at. Yes, yeah, so I feel like actually now that we've encur yeah. encountered several magic things, we should Stop really investigate door. magic. Yes. yes, I almost think we should bring him along next time. You did discuss bringing him over here to look at the tower, and yeah, so uh, if we do that, we have to be totally prepared for like an apocalypse scenario. Just so you know. Well, I, <laughs> that was our... I'm all, I, I assume that if we bring him, we will just be made aware of the things that we, you know, potentially could be doing. It's like, oh, we shouldn't be here. He'll tell us, and we'd be like, why? Because of this magic thing. We'd be like, well, as long as we don't do anything magical, we'll be fine, right? Right. I do. I do believe that we were told that you never, you know, like the Psy Stalkers didn't trust magic folk because they tend to want to open the portals. What portals? Rudge. <laughs> <laughs> I get that you're a non-believer. You're a flat earther. <laughs> it's not but my I... fault. I roll that crit fail. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's great. I love it. I absolutely love it. Um, Rudge. You have to believe me. There are portals that open up in the universe and make stuff like this happen. You just experienced a creature. Surely that... portals, but like portals this big? Nah. No. I've never seen it. anything, any like, evidence to support that. We we currently have a geological formation that does not make sense in this terrain or geographic location. How do you explain this then? Ugh. <sighs> Well, <laughs> granted, I don't. I know that we don't know everything, so you know, just because we don't know doesn't mean it couldn't happen. I feel like just because the two of us don't know, this couldn't happen. We are two of the best. <laughs> if we don't know, then it is unknown. Although I, I do want to point out, Will has fucking zero geographical knowledge, so it could literally be like a volcano in the middle of like oh, okay. the North Pole, and she'd be like, "All right, <laughs> yep, that makes sense." <laughs> <laughs> yep. Do it up. I'll allow it. <laughs> yeah, like, like I, I think it's weird and it probably shouldn't be there, but it is, so I'm not going to disagree with it. I can see it. Yep. I'm, I'm not going to tell it stop. <laughs> okay. But, all right, all right, uh, all right. So let's say portals. They, I think he one of their... to open them. Why would we let him and why would he want What if to? it's unwilling? What is? The we, I, or what if? Well, what if something... We do know that mind control is a thing. Yes. What if something takes control of his mind and opens the portal? Uh, how fast could they do it? <laughs> I, we have no idea. Maybe instantaneous? If it's anything less than that, he would be unconscious within a second. Assuming we recognize what he's doing. Uh, he's kind of a weird guy. We like. He is erratic. Then, like, then we will issue strict rules upon his magic gestures. I love that plan, but looking at him, I don't think he'll follow any of them from day one. There's... <laughs> All right. Him and I have a rapport. If he doesn't, I am willing to throw that out the window for some strict... <laughs> uh, for, you know, our way or the highway. I mean, I'm okay with that, because, I mean, like, my other side of this is, like, 
This planet's already looked like it's gone through apocalypse, so what's the second one going to do to it? <laughs> well, now that could just make things much more difficult for us, especially for me to get... Uh, well, my thought Shit was that back. if, say, an apocalypse scenario happens, chances are the Coalition will be less guarding their bases than more.